All right, what's going on here anymore is the question of the day. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Boss for I Shinobi. We have episodes 369, nice, and 370 of our One Piece watch through, and things are questionable. The fight against the Oars has gone quite well, but there's kind of a new wrench in the mix with Kuma, Tyrant Kuma, being in Thriller Bark now, a, another warlord, looking for both Moria and Luffy. I'm hyped to get into it, kind of scared. If you knew the channel, drop a sub and hit that big wood bell, and let's get started. Shadow Moria's face, bro. I, like, I cannot believe you fell for this. Where is it going? Isn't Moria still in the forest? Or is Moria actually like back up in the castle? Oh my gosh. I guess it's possible. You know Luffy! It's kind of ironic that Luffy doesn't have his shadow now, but Brook does. They've sort of swapped the boats. Oh wait, Sanji and Zoro still don't have theirs. Because the zombie and the penguin are still fighting. I just kind of feel uneasy now with Kuma here. So he's just going to go back up into the castle? Ay ay ay. Another standoff. Round three. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Zoro, Zoro wanted to sort of test his limits here, I think. I mean, if he killed Ors, what would happen to Luffy? Would his shadow be fine or no? I don't know if they ever specified that. They specify the opposite. Hey, man, Zoro's confident. Yeah, Sanji tried, and it didn't work out. Heavier. He's just getting a feel for things, guys. It's okay. It'll be able to cut through more, right? Since it's heavier? Check. That's bundle. Oh, it's way like thicker now. I like him like discovering things about it. He's like, whoa, that was that, that was pretty big. Absorb the ones from the Oh my gosh! He got he's gotta hone it a little bit. Oh, hell yeah. Well, yeah, but it's like a higher skill ceiling. So it's inherently a good thing he lost his old one. I feel like he can't see. Or is this such a big target, man? The way he steps, man. Like, he's big, but he's fast. Oh, my God. That looks so badass. He actually toppled him by himself. Holy. Another 108 pounds. He's turned it into an elbow slam. Into the shadows. Oh, my gosh. Where did he go? Hey, he did leave a, de a dent. He's gonna try out some. Oh no, he, he's trying to hone the Phoenix. Since he said it was, there was excess damage the first time, he's gonna do it over and over again. He's just repping on ores, bro. To an extent, again, he has to force Moria to give up the shadows. Yeah, I don't think it's that Zoro doesn't believe in Luffy. Oh. Oh, like being tricked? True. He hasn't up until now. That's Luffy's biggest weakness. He's naive. 30 minutes until sunrise? Oh my gosh, there's gonna be spots? Oh gosh. That's so, like, shady, though. Yeah, they'd have to go into hiding. Boy, it has been one long night, I will say. It's been the same night since they got there, right? I think so. They've been here! Oh, wait, yeah, they did say that Thriller Bark itself was on a bad path what would happen if it did hit land or hit something else the sky is falling the pre-dawn sky oh wait does throw bark like never leave the florian triangle they're on another course it just means they're on like the regular seas maybe oh so there wouldn't be a fog so like a lot of zombies would just die oh, it's usually permanent the star of hope's crew did you talk about luffy did they call luffy the star of hope why can't we see their faces an ambush they're gonna help him oh hell yeah oh wait oh i thought these were the ones that lost their souls and like asked luffy for help it's the exact opposite well inherently this is all because of wars it's not even because of the straw hats Wars is gonna mess with the, the rudder either way yeah moria moria actually did come all the way back up here dude because wouldn't a lot of, of zombies and stuff die from the sunlight Oh no, because the zombies do have the shadows. Oh. oh shoot. Oh shoot. They're having a meeting, baby. Oh, how did he get up there so fast? I'm I'm beyond interested to see what, what Kuma has to tell Gecko Moria. 
God, they're both units, man. Only warlord who does the government's bidding. He's he's a behaved dog. Says you. Oh, he's asking him the question. What are they? He said, whoa, buddy. Chill. A report. Wait, what? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Wait, did Blackbeard get it? Oh, my gosh. Blackbeard's going to be a warlord. Oh, my gosh. Holy. So he came just to tell Gekko Moria who their new co-worker is? Is it because of what happened with Ace? He made enough of, like, commotion? We never even saw how that all, like, ended up. It just showed Ace's hat at the end. I bet he did that. Hurt Ace real bad. He showed the government. He was like, hey, look, I can, I can do your bidding really, really easily. Take out some high-level pirates. God, it was such a firefight. Absolute banger. So, I mean, I, I honestly, I'm not too shocked. I don't know who else they would have picked for the, the position after Crocodile was let go. I actually don't know. What was it? Oh, what? Oh, because he was part of Whitebeard's crew. I guess not everybody has their own bounty. Does Kuma know, like, how, like, Whitebeard feels about Blackbeard? And how Shanks does? They're worried about Luffy and them? them here would be high. I don't think Gekko Moria sees them as a threat at all. Dang! The government doesn't have enough faith in Gekko Moria. That's gonna piss him off. Oh, holy dang dude he came to help holy oh my gosh i like seeing gecko mori get like a get heated get mad yeah true so luchi had a pretty big name for himself yeah i mean luffy hasn't even used second gear against gecko moria yet like i i think he's been held, holding back like crazy so the government was like hey we gotta stop luffy and the straw hats before they get even further especially because if word made it out that they defeated another warlord gecko then there would be much more of an uprise from the emperors to take a move on the government and the warlords it almost feels like overkill oh he's just asking if he wants help He's just gonna sit there and watch. He's defending his home. He's gotta be strong enough if he wants to be king of the pirates, bro. Damn, that's crazy. The Straw Hats got it. I know they got a name for themselves, especially after Indy's lobby, but they actually predicted them beating Gecko Moria. I just love like, like politics stuff like that in One Piece so much. He's here! He's coming out! And Luffy's nowhere to be found. Wait, where is he? He's inside, Ors! Oh my god! How did he even get inside? Since when did he go into the back or something? Oh, shoot. It's like his machine. Luffy's just lost, man. Don't even consider it, Frankie. Don't even waver. Dude, Moria looks so tiny inside Ors. I'll be. He's poking him. <laughs> he can't. He's kicking his fingers. You are quite literally a robot. Well, not really. Zombie's a little bit different. He's role playing a robot. Ors Bomber. That's a pretty good name for on the spot because it sounds cool. Where did Chopper get a cape from? Has he had that? Am I trolling? If Ors shakes up too much, Gecko's gonna go flying around. Oh, this is like final boss Gecko Moria form. They kind of still have Shadow Moria to worry about too. I think you shift your, your focus to finding the Zoro and Sanji zombie first. Sun's gonna come out soon. Brook's on it, man. He's trying. I would imagine they don't keep like an overwhelming load of, of salt here too, just in case. Go, go, go. He's just gonna run into Brook. Oh no. Well, now Oris can actually take commands and do his bidding. He's, he's kind of got like the brains now. He's gonna do whatever Gecko tells him to. Oh! Chopper's face! Just punched Usopp into the building! He went so far, he's missing. Uh, Brook! Yes! Let's go! In a giant bag of salt! My goat! My goat!
Brock this. I am your Brock. I love that, dude. All right, like I said, this is sort of final boss. I guess Kuma's just gonna sit by the side and watch, but the problem now is if they do get close enough or they do get close to defeating him, then he's gonna step in, and I, pff, I don't know what we can handle. I mean, there's a possibility of just running away, but we don't really know what Kuma's powers are. 370, let's go. <laughs> God dang right, he drank some milk. Literally saved his life, saved Usopp's life. Drank away. He he's like still cracked, but it looks like it's like it's like yeah, fixed a little bit. <laughs> he's still missing a tooth. Gorg came in clutch, baby. It's a cool like final boss type. Gecko Moria inside of him. He's a very I, I think Buggy would like him. He's a very flashy villain. Keep shining. <laughs> he's probably got so many tricks like hidden up his sleeve. Yeah, he's probably gonna help fight the ultimate nightmare. <laughs> it's like their battle calls. Let's go for them getting the shadow back. Yeah. <laughs> Stay on top of the salt. He's on salt duty. Anti monster shells. Is that what he's been carrying too? Besides the nunchucks? Oh, they're combining. Let's go, boys. Oh, hell yeah. Look at the teamwork. Okay, so what does Gecko Moria do from in there? Contraception ready? Huh? Oh, yeah, because it doesn't actually hurt him. It can't. The zombies can't feel pain. Oh, God dang it. <laughs> he can actually kind of use it to his advantage. I mean, the most they can do is try to burn the skin away, which I don't think it will. They're focused, man. They're locked in. No room for error. Oh, Luffy is still MIA. I love when they launch each other so much. What? Oh, Sanji's going to kick him, isn't he? He looks so over this, man. Oh, he's just showing off. Okay, he's actually showing off. Oh, he's gonna kick the building. Oh my god. That's amazing. Oh my gosh. How are those cuts so clean? No, he's in the back. I love how Brooks like Yoho is like every emotion. Oh my god, he broke. Grab Brook! Oh, hell yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Super. Even from the ground. New weapon. Huagata. Oh my gosh. A kind of slingshot. Oh my God. Is, is he going to shoot Frankie? Drop the super pose. How does he, how does he do that? Dude, you know when Usopp has the goggles on, he means business. Frankie! Oh my gosh, he's literally just gonna launch Frankie into him. Frankie, I swear, was made for the straw hats. He's built for the straw hats. Literally. He's just crisscross, man! Against Sea Kings. No, Mori is gonna have some counterplay. Oh, he's just gonna dodge. Yeah. So is that why he's agile? It's Luke, because it's Luffy's shadow? Oh no, Frankie. He got smacked. Oh my god. Oh. Somebody save him! Get off! Surely somebody. Is this how Luffy makes his return? Or Nami getting back? Nami still isn't here. Thank god they're actually running in this time. Unlike when Sanji's getting rolled. Thank you. Thank you. I was waiting for it. Oh, she's, she's out of the wedding dress. Who could it have been? Just saved Frankie's life. Oh, did he fall on him? Where is she? All the zombies are still just spectating. <laughs> just standing all the way up there. Dang, dude, I liked the dress. Is she like embarrassed? <laughs> Aww, please forgive me. His little fans. <laughs> And now she dies. Still says gum gum before every move. Nah, don't worry about it, Nami. He just thinks he can. What? Wait, did he actually just stretch? It looks like... Oh my god, he did! How? You can't just develop devil fruit abilities. 
Can you? Dude did it seamlessly. Maybe it's like mechanics he put in Or's arm ahead of time. She's still screaming. <laughs> uh, the gang's back together aside from Luffy. I feel like Gecko Mori has got enough of an ego to where he could he'll explain it. It either has to do with the fact that the shadow's been in him long enough or there are like mechanics or something. Oh no, they're getting rolled now. And they are going to if he can actually stretch. All right, bud. You, surely you get back soon, right? Oh my gosh. They're actually just going to mess with him. Tee hee. Wait, no, these are the ones that asked for his help, but that are going to stop him. Oh, the risky Captain Marriage proposal, Lola? What's your deal? They're so lying. Why don't you just tell him? He's getting conned, man. He's getting scamazed the whole nine. Marriage proposal, Lola? What? Yeah. Wait, she has two blades like the boar, Lola. What is going on? What is happening? Is that Lola's original body? Oh, it is, isn't it? Oh my gosh. And she leads them? The victim network. Okay, so then why did we hear them like planning against them? Maybe it didn't show their faces for a reason. Oh no, that's true. No, they're actually telling the truth. But why would they not? Yeah, they, they would want to defeat Moria. They are pretty like uh, like in tune with what's going on too. Oh my gosh. Sees it himself. Okay, there's some secret. Oh, they have a shadow. Oh my gosh. You can catch it and give it to someone else. Oh wait, what? He's like throwing up. Your body would reject it. You would be a different person though. They are tricking him. They just wanted to use it as an experiment to find out. Does he have an eyeliner now? Uh. Oh my gosh. What the hell? He's got two personalities now. Skilled Navy swordsman. Wait, did they do that just to expand his arsenal to help defeat Gecko Moria? Put in as many shadows? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Not his willpower is strong. Wait, this is such an absurd plan, but I'm here for it. But it wouldn't matter in the end if they're able to defeat Gecko Moria because they would just leave him and go to the original owner, I think. And then his would come back to him. 10 minute power up. Oh, okay. It'll reject it eventually. Oh my gosh. They just have a bunch tied up. This is so absurd. What a crazy plan. The time, the clock's ticking. How do you know that? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is force feeding him shadows. Well, how do you feel, Luffy? 100? When you couldn't handle two or three. Uh, L Luffy? Did you lose your mind? It'd be your fault, man. Oh my gosh, he's so large. He's built like Chopper now. They have a giant blade! Dang, you guys were really prepared with this plan. I wanna see him. Let me see him. He looks huge now. Yeah, I think y'all are wasting too much time, to be honest. Oh my gosh! He is huge. Nightmare Luffy. I love that. He's off! So there's no chance one of those was Zoro's shadow, right? Because that would just make all the more sense. Okay, things just take every single possible turn in every single possible direction to where I can't predict a single thing anymore. Nightmare Luffy is now on his way. Who knows how he'll act? But again, I I, I don't I feel like Gecko Moria has really been holding back everything that he can do because I mean, if he has that much confidence in himself and he still has ores, he has to have so many tricks up his sleeve. Like they said, everything on this island is is built to 
sort of trick you. But maybe Luffy, with all those souls in him, won't doubt himself or anything. And instead, he'll just, uh, just it'll just raw strength. But dude, like I said, everything that's occurring would be crazy. But Kuma being here just adds like like tenfold. It's just in the back of my mind now. It's just lingering. It makes me anxious. But guys, that's been it for episode 369, 370 of our One Piece watch. Do drop a sub on the channel if you are new. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace, peace.